Hello, beloveds. Happy Friday. Happy Friday. I wanted to take a moment to tune in and turn on with you and find out how you're doing after that Pisces full moon. We have been in for quite a doozy of energy these last, you know, few months. I was going to say days, but uh, no, it's been months. But this Pisces new moon gave us a real sense of ourselves and has really brightened and enlightened us. In fact, many of us are learning more and more about ourselves. In fact, even for myself, I've been in my little bit of uh, a writing cocoon, studying, um, doing research for my book, doing all these different things. And so Miana and I, my beloved daughter, have some great things coming in store for you. So stay tuned. I will be popping in and out, but I will we'll definitely bring in some new things. But I want to get back to this energy of, you know, what we've been feeling, you know, and many of us, of course, I can't speak for everyone, but as a collective, there is an energy of inspiration and many of us are seeking our, our own and higher enlightenment. The cats are fighting, <laughs> as you can hear. And so that's why I love talking about tarot and connecting with tarot because for me i see tarot as a portal and it's a portal to our intuition and so i'll be diving into that in um the anyone can tarot uh facebook group so if you're not in that join that and then at 11 30 i'll be on with well set co um, and i'll be talking about tarot as a portal but i'll be talking about it from two different angles and the reason i'm talking about it so much is because so many people are looking for something to help them understand and this isn't about understanding with logic and knowledge because all knowledge is truly of spirit but this is that knowing for yourself that is learning to trust your intuition that is learning to trust yourself and your ancestors so you know, it is a tool for us to know ourselves better, to become more aware. And so that's how I see tarot and that's how we teach it and anyone can tarot because tarot is and was created as an initiation tool, an initiation into what? So join me at 11 and then again at 1130. And again, all the links are in bio. You can become a member of the anyone, or I'm sorry, you can become a member of the Tanya's House of Tarot. And then two, if you want to join the Wellset Co, go on over there and follow them as well and sign up for the link so you can get into the Zoom room with me in about 30 minutes. But, you know, I realize that I have, you know, I, I have been in a little bit of cave and there's been so many new people. So I'll be sharing more with you. You know, I'll be sharing more writing, um, my writing journey of this book. Uh, I'll be sharing more, just more of who I am as well as in anyone can tarot and brown girls who coach and more than anything right now brown girls who coach is something we are really really excited about because i know as a brown woman as a black woman i know what i needed as a safe space and i realized after 20 years or, you know actually that's not true my whole life many of my teachers and those i looked up to have been white people and i'm not saying that that's something wrong but what i do know is that we learn better from ourselves and that's even why i was a school librarian in low-income school districts back when i was you know a librarian in chicago because i knew that teaching children from someone who looks like them they learn better and so brown girls who coach is you know, not just for life coaches, but for tarot, for, you know, if you are a psychic, if you're, it's for all those different things. So if that is you, please follow us over there at Brown Girls Who Coach because we need a safe space. And, and so we've got some really great stuff coming up for you. I just wanted to tune in and share with you, you know, you are not alone. We've got seven planets that will be retrograde very soon. And so this is our time to power up and tarot is a wonderful way for us to power up because more than anything right now, we need spiritual practice. We need spirit. We need God, goddess. We need the ancestors connecting us, aligning us and supporting us in ways that we never thought possible. And that's why I love tarot as a portal because what other tool do you have that teaches you about yourself that you can use on a daily basis that is accessible to you 
Luckily, there's more and more decks coming out. I've got something special to show, share with you very soon about that and just so many other things. So find ways to harness your power, find ways to connect to your light. And, and then let's talk about tarot. So I'm about to pop on over to the Facebook group for Tanya's House of Tarot and I will be connecting more with you soon. Somebody asked, do I practice Santeria? Uh, yes and no. So like I said, I'll be sharing more about myself, my journey and my upcoming book, but also more information and insight. So I'm going to pop on over to Facebook. I hope you'll join me. And if not, also join me later today at 2 p.m. on the show up. If you are a spiritual entrepreneur and you've got you know, business questions and things. I'll also be talking about tarot in your business and as a pair, as a, as a portal into your intuition as well. So I hope you'll join me today. I've got some other good stuff coming up and until next time, beloved, know you are loved and you are the light until next time. Peace and blessings. Happy Friday.